Hi lovely people, so today I am back with another sorting and organizing my K-pop binders. Hopefully this one shouldn't be super long. I do have a few things, but most of them are like OT9 twice sets, so hopefully they won't take a super long time to get through. But as always, I still wanted to film it and pop this up for you guys because I do know that some of you do particularly enjoy these organizing videos. So as per all my other organizing videos, I am just going to sort them and sleeve any that I need to and then I will be right back. Okay, so first off, I am going to start with my BTS binder, just because I have one lone Jungkook card to put away. So this is his double-sided PC from BTS World. So that is all I have to put away, so... Oh, I have that. Oh, I have marked it. <laughs> um, doo -doo 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 -doo. No, what am I doing? So that was literally all for my BTS binder. Um, hopefully I'll have some more stuff coming in soon for BTS. So that would be good. Um, but now I will go on to my alts binder. So we are just going to put um, some of my memo cards away. As you can probably see, I'm not sure if any of you will recall, but I've actually changed the inserts for my binders. I found these ones the other day and I actually like them quite a bit more. So, <laughs> okay, so first off to put away, we have the two special Twice Coastal Lane 1 Christmas cards. So. I just kept these ones the same because I knew I was going to get rid of them. So we have the selfie one, and then the hollow one. Cute! This page is almost done, so I'm just waiting for the signal cards I have coming from eBay. Um, so next we have to go to Yes or Yes. 
Here we go. So we have her individual outfit. So she can go there. And then I left a spot for her hand card. So go there and then it finishes off the page that looks so nice i'm again just waiting on this yes or yes white border card um, and then so as you can see oh <laughs> making a mess as always i have mapped out all of the more and more cards that i have coming for her so these are all just her individual cards um i haven't really left any space for the units because i didn't know if i was going to put them in this binder or in with my other twice cards so for now i'm just going to pop them in here just because i have a free space so she can go there but what do you guys think should i put my like unit cards with my like ot9 twice stuff or should i keep them in here with my momo stuff i'd like to see what you think but yeah as you can see i have all of momo's cards coming so hopefully they should all get to me soon okay so that was everything for my alt binder i said this is going super quickly i really like this usually my collection videos take like forever so this is a nice change of pace but now we're going to get onto the thing with the most stuff so i'm going to grab my girl group finder this is definitely where all the cards come into play so um let's get stuck into this this binder is so full i think i'm gonna have to like separate this and do like just a twice binder anyway okay so i've got to remember which was which okay so i believe this is version a so i'm gonna grab some nine pocket sleeves yeah i definitely think i'm gonna have to get a fourth binder which that's ridiculous i am aware <laughs> But it's just getting way too full. Especially because I like to keep, obviously, all these OT9 sets. So. But I love them. As I said in my unboxing video from More & More, which if you haven't seen it, you can check up here. Um, that I love these pre-order sets. They just really outdid themselves. <laughs> so we have that set there which is the black border i'll put the group away in a little bit and then we'll put this in for version b it actually would make more sense to just there you go <laughs> i always make things super hard for myself okay so let's grab so here we have the version b cards I said I got it back to front in my unboxing video. I think I got version B right, but I said that A was C and C was A, so I goofed. <laughs> I love this set so much. Except for Nina's card. It really bugs me. She looks beautiful, but just like no one at JB like <laughs> at JYP know how to use like Photoshop. They could have just photoshopped the background. It would have made it like so much more cohesive. But I guess it is what it is. Beautiful. So that was the B set. And then we can move on to the C set. I love this one, like kind of like the outdoorsy vibe. I love this card of Momo, like it's so pretty. She looks so wholesome. I will put the group one on the group card page and then actually I'm done I've got to put another set in here for the with drama cards oh I love the backs of them they're so nice okay 
So obviously this is the pre-order benefit that you got if you ordered from With Drama. So I was super, super thankful that I was able to get the OT9 set because I was a bit worried because they just came in like random sets of three members and then a group card. I just love the hollow. So we obviously have all of the sets, the pre-order benefits for more and more. And then I will just have to put in another sleeve for the group cards. Thank goodness I bought more sleeves because I would have been running out. <laughs> okay, so for here I've got obviously all the order benefits and then we have the most card which I was calling the more and more card like in my unboxing I'm actually dumb sometimes Let's put that in there and then we got version B and then look at JYP putting them all up the right way for once <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, so yeah, that was all of the group cards, which I really like. I like that the most card will be in the middle because it's a little bit bigger. So, awesome. And then the next thing I have to put away is my twice to gram monograph set. So, that will fit in right here. I'm so close to being like done with my monographs. I'm so excited. <laughs> So as I said, I will hopefully be looking for the What Is Love one soon, if I can ever just come across it for a good price. But the Cheer Up one, I don't know, or well, the Page 2 one. Perfect. And Like You is such an iconic song, so I'm so happy that I have this. So that was everything for that set. I'm so happy to now have like most of them. So, do a quick flip through. Question, does anyone want to see a binder flip through? Um, like obviously of all my binders because I am still obviously waiting on my more and more stuff. But if anyone wants to see one, I can definitely film one. And I can do it maybe in the next couple of videos. So the next video I'm going to upload will be like a how to start a photo card binder, I guess, photo card collection, just from personal experience. And then I can probably film a binder tour after that if anyone is interested. <laughs> um, so yeah, they're obviously all the monograph sets. And the next thing we'll go on to will be Itzy. So also, can we talk about Itzy having a comeback in like July? We are being spoiled. I can't deal. <laughs> Okay, so we have um, this one here from It's Icy, super cute, obviously as you can tell I didn't know what to name this one so it just became the It's Icy one. <laughs> so that goes there, and then we have her wannabe, so it's me, um, the W card, and then I'm actually done with um, Ryujin for wannabe, so cool. And then obviously I have the group card. Once there's another comeback, this will probably change, but for now I'm just going to put it on the back here. Yeah, I think that's cute. And that is, also I'm just going to adjust my camera. Um, camera, it's my phone. Um, that's the only unit that I want to collect just because it was Rujin and Yuna. And then we have her signature card for It's Icy. So this one will go here. I'm so close to having them all done. I'm so excited. It would be so good to like have this finished and be like up to date with all of them. So super happy about that. 
um, and then we have the pre-orders which I don't know if I actually have any two pocket sleeves give me a sec <laughs> okay so I'm dumb I just realized that I'm completely out of two pocket sleeves so I won't be putting these away at the moment I will do it in the future so I'm just gonna stick them back in here for now I did have someone suggest that maybe like three pocket sleeves would be best for these so I might look into doing that as well okay so that is all for itsy and then we have silgy um so i just remembered that i don't put these in my binder so i'm just going to put that back in the album and then i have her day two postcard which i will probably just put this put this here actually let's put this here and then put this here beautiful Them. so yeah the only inclusion i'm missing now for sugi for her like non-photo card um inclusions is her day one standee which hopefully i should be getting soon and then we have solreen to focus on but that is a whole nother story um so i'm super excited for that like so excited and then the next thing we have is miss jenny kim so we have her pigtail um other the second black version from Kill This Love. That's big, so this goes here. So I actually have, I need to fill this in, but I have the rest of my Jenny collection coming. So that's gonna be done before their comeback, which is so exciting. I did not think that would happen. But yeah, I'm super, super thankful for that. But yeah, that was everything for this whole video. It was a nice shorter one, which I appreciate. Makes you guys not have to sit through anything super long. So. It is always a bonus in my books, but let me um, get all my other binders and I'll do a wrap up. Okay, so that was absolutely everything for this organizing my binders video. Again, a nice short one, so it was nice. But yeah, please let me know if you guys would like to see a binder tour. As I said, I know more and more I haven't got all the cards yet. Oh, the lighting just changed real hard on me that's one um i know i haven't got lots of momos more and more cards so let me know if you'd like me to do it before or after i get those in but yeah so thank you so much for watching i hope you have a lovely day and i will see you on the next video bye